Hi everybody, welcome back to Glittery Life. Thank you so much for watching today. If you're new, click that little subscribe button. Or if you've been watching me for a while and you still haven't subscribed, I would love it if you would. So go ahead and click that little subscribe button. It's free and it actually is awesome. So that'll mean you'll get my videos popping up in your newsfeed and you'll never miss any of the action over here at Glittery Life. Today my video for you is a collab with my good friend Summer from Les Musings of Moi and you've seen Summer all over my Instagram and all that kind of stuff. She lives in San Diego so any chance that she gets a, to get up to LA we always hang out. She's so amazing. We've done a collab video before quite a while ago and we're going to do another one today and this is a really fun collab. So I was watching recently, I was watching one of Summer's videos and she was talking about how she was like shopping her stash and like going through her stuff and I, I like sent her, I voxered her and I was like, hey Summer, don't you think it'd be so fun if we did like a shop your stash collab where we have to like go through our archives and pick out stuff that we haven't used or we're not using and then like reintroduce it into to our collections and use it for a while. So um, I want to show you what I pulled out of my makeup collection to sort of reintroduce. I've got like a box for you. I definitely limited it. I definitely had to limit myself um, because I had to be realistic about this. But one of the first things that I pulled out of my stash is the Naked 2 palette. I can tell you for certain that I have not used this eyeshadow palette once this entire year. For 2014, I have not even opened this gorgeous palette up. I don't know why. I definitely do gravitate towards this more in the winter because um, it's kind of a cool tone palette. It's got some cooler colors for my skin tone. Uh, it does have some warmer colors in it as well, but I think once the Naked 3 came out, I just was so obsessed with that. And you'll see here, I have a video coming up soon with my eyeshadow palette collection so you'll see that I don't have any shortage of eyeshadow palettes and I did limit that to just my actual like palettes that other companies have made not the palettes that I've curated myself so but I really love this palette and so I'm going to reintroduce this back into my life which means this has to be packed in my travel bag for some upcoming trips so I'm really serious I'm going to use this I'm going to reintroduce these into my life one of the other things that I cannot believe I haven't used in forever and I did not use, I don't think I used it once this summer, is Chanel uh, Soleil Tan de Chanel. And honestly, like, I've like barely made a dent in this baby. I mean, it has like a little dent in the center, but I need to get, I, this was expensive. I need to use this more. This was a gift. Um, and I, I actually do like this product. I still try to like, I'm still not totally sure always how to work with it, but I definitely need to be busting this out a little bit more and giving it some love because I don't want it to go bad. But as you can tell, I'm very fair skinned, so uh, it's tricky. But I love it, I wanna use it some more. Another product that I wanna, that I, that I pulled from my stash that I haven't been using very much and I cannot believe it because I love it. It's the NARS Guy Bourdain Holiday Blush Palette. Look, at, I'm, a, I'm like kind of a nerd. I leave my, does anybody else leave their plastic covers? Only when they sit, like only on NARS do I do that and not on the eyeshadows because I depot all those. But so you can see this is a beautiful blush palette plus a bronzer plus Laguna. It's the Laguna bronzer plus a highlight. And I don't know why I don't use this, especially for traveling. Um, I do think I took this, I might have taken this to Hawaii with me in May, but I can't remember because I didn't really wear makeup on that trip. So anyway, reintroducing this back into my life. Um, something else that I'm going to commit to using that I've pulled out of my stash is the Hourglass Luminous Light Powder. I don't know why. Same thing. I haven't been using this. I have hardly... I mean, like, you can't even tell that I've used this. So, and I love this. I love the hourglass powders. I definitely use dim light a lot more, but um, I think luminous light is so beautiful. So I'm going to bust this out as well. The color on my lips, oh my gosh, isn't this so gorgeous? It's such a beautiful nude. And it's the Milani Nude Cream, color 26. And I haven't used this in forever. And I think partly because in the summer, I tend to gravitate more towards that, like, really bold, bright, crazy lip, and um, orange, purple, hot pink, fuchsia, whatever, and so, or lip gloss, like a bright lip gloss. So this this lipstick um, hasn't really gotten any love recently, but I love the way it smells. I'm always still trying to figure out what it smells like. Is it like, 
it's you know what it smells like is one time I saw Katy Perry in concert in London and this is what the whole room smelled like she pumps this like candy sweet fragrance into the like whole audit like whole space or whatever and that's what it smells like um okay something else for my eyes oh my gosh I can't believe I haven't used this in forever this is the L'Oreal infallible amber rush pressed pigment and this is one of my faves I am busting this out I love this product so I'm gonna be using this uh, and that's pretty with the Naked 2 palette as well. And something else for my stash, and the reason why this is, like I haven't used it is because it's not been the right season, but it's the MAC Lavish Living Mineralized Blush. This is like limited edition that came out last year. It's so beautiful. Like literally is like the most like gorgeous kind of like taupey plum. And I really, really like it. Perfect for fall, so this is definitely coming out of the archives. The other thing that I pulled out, it's so funny because I actually bought this one time when I was with Summer and Melissa. Melissa is uh, from Honey Bee Philosophy and I think I've used it one time. I just haven't quite got the hang of it, but Summer has one and she loves it. She has a different color, but it's the Stila Metallic uh, Magnificent Metal Eyes Shadow and mine's the Metallic Merlot. Um, I just figured, gosh, that's so perfect for fall. And I thought also to just, I mean, in, in coincidence, and coincidentally, I think this will look pretty with the Naked 2 palette as well and also Amber Rush. So it comes in a little pot and then you mix it with this like little drop of stuff and like mine's like basically gone. So I bet you can maybe mix it with some Fix Plus or something. I don't know. I'm gonna have to experiment with this because it is really pretty. I just need to actually use it. So those are my out of the archives, shop my stash, products that I'm gonna use. I would love for you to go over and check out Summer's video and check out her channel. If you haven't subscribed to her, subscribe to her as well, especially if you're interested in more like natural stuff, like natural food, like Vitacost, like all that kind of stuff. I learned a lot about the more like natural, like beauty and food and all that kind of stuff from her. Plus she's just a really lovely person and she's so pretty and she's my like bang sister. And I also want to encourage you to shop your stash, especially because the holidays are coming up. I can't believe it. I have a countdown on my phone to tell me how many days it is till Christmas. And actually I shouldn't say how many days it is till Christmas because I'm filming this video before it's going up because I'm actually in Dallas right now. Um, but it's like about 90 days probably at the point when this video goes up it's probably about like 90 days or so till Christmas and so you guys I gotta like save my pennies I don't know about you so it's definitely a good season to shop your stash and if you are shopping your stash leave me a comment down below and let me know what you're gonna reintroduce into your collection and if there was something that you saw uh, that I just posted and that you want to see a review or a tutorial with, just go ahead and let me know and we'll see if I can do that. So you guys, thanks for thumbs up in this video. Thank you for subscribing and thanks for being gorgeous and awesome. Have an awesome day.